Nope, your eyes are not deceiving you. It doesn't look like much, but I'll tell you, there are some hugely important upgrades to the redesigned 2024 Ford F-150, particularly surrounding the Power Boost hybrid drivetrain. As you'd expect for a mid-cycle update, there are no real foundational changes to this vehicle. Once again, it rides atop a fully boxed, high-strength steel frame. The body and bed are both made out of military-grade aluminum alloy. And of course, Ford is claiming best-in-class payload and towing performance, so no real surprises for 2024. All right, this is perhaps the coolest feature of the redesigned 2024 Ford F-150. This is the Pro Access tailgate, and it's basically a response to the fancy tailgates that GM and Ram have offered for several years now. And I'll tell you what models this is available on in just a minute. But first, an overview. As you can see, this is essentially a swing door within a tailgate. If I push a button here, the whole thing drops down, just like you would expect. No surprises, but if I lift it again, hit the separate button, you'll see this whole center section swings right out, just like that, giving you very easy access to the bed. If you wanna grab your groceries or whatever, it's simple to do. You don't have to climb over the tailgate. Now, as you can see, this is in its widest setting. This is a full 100 degrees that it opens, gives you plenty of room to access the bed. There's also a detent at 70 degrees and then 37. And this setting right here was designed for towing because obviously if you've got your trailer, your trailer jack, whatever else, it could be very easy to swing this door right into that and dent it. So they put the detent at 37 degrees, which still gives you good access to the bed without causing any damage to the body. Speaking of access, depending on models, They've deepened and widened the step here in the bumper, again, to make it easier to get into the bed. Additionally, they will have moved the trailer connection ports over to the passenger side of the truck. That's not the case here. This is a Tremor model. It has the older bumper. It also has dual exhaust, so they have not retooled that just yet to move these to the passenger side. But other versions of the new F-150 have those over here on the right, so you're not tripping over those cables when you're trying to climb into the bed. Overall, I think this Pro Access tailgate is super clever and frankly a must-have feature, though curiously Ford is not going to put this on the Lightning all-electric truck, which is really weird. You'd think they'd want that on their most technologically advanced version of the F-150, but I imagine that will be coming in the future. Overall, the Pro Access tailgate is very nice, though I don't think it's quite as versatile as GM's Multi-Pro tailgate, which, if you remember, is sort of like a tailgate within a tailgate. This is much more similar to the Ram Multi-Function tailgate, which is kind of like two different barn doors. While we're at the back of the truck here, I've got to talk about storage because they've added a couple of cubbies to the bed. Might be hard to see, but behind this little plastic door is a great little storage nook. It's about 3.7 liters, a little bit less than a gallon, but that's enough to store some gloves or other small tools. Additionally, F-150s that are not fitted with Pro Power onboard, the automaker's sort of electricity export system, you get another cubby over on the driver's side as well. Aside from that Pro Access tailgate, the other big story for 2024 is, well, it's kind of boring, but it's hugely important. Ford has really repackaged the options and features that are available in the 2024 F-150 to dramatically reduce the number of buildable combinations. They've slashed them by 90% compared to 2023, and that sounds like bad news for customers, but it shouldn't be because they have not taken any features away and they're specking trucks the way people are basically already buying them. And this big change should also help improve quality and make it much simpler to order an F-150. Next, let's talk about the Power Boost Hybrid. This was introduced back in 2021, and Ford has sold about 100,000 trucks fitted with this drivetrain. It's running at about 10% of their sales mix. But the big news for 2024 is that they're actually doubling the production of the Power Boost Hybrid drivetrain, and they're going to price it accordingly. It's going to have the same price as the 3.5 liter EcoBoost V6, which is going to save you about $1,900. The Power Boost Hybrid drivetrain will be available from the XLT trim all the way up to the new Platinum Plus grade. It's going to get you 430 horsepower and 570 pound-feet of torque. Unfortunately, there's not a lot to talk about in the new F-150's cabin because the 2023 model is already so very nice, but there are a few features of note. 
A digital instrument cluster is standard across the range. Ditto for a 12-inch touchscreen on the center of the dashboard. Also new for 2024 is an available head-up display. Now, of course, Ford is also bringing Blue Cruise 1.2 to this pickup truck, which has some welcome upgrades over Blue Cruise 1.0. You get things like in-lane repositioning, so if you're driving past, say, a big truck on the highway, it will automatically scoot the vehicle over in its lane of travel, just like you would do as a driver. Blue Cruise 1.2 also supports automatic lane change capability. Just tap your turn signal, and the F-150 will change lanes automatically when it is safe to do so. Ford is also adding 10 standard driver aids to the F-150 for 2024. This includes a whole host of things like blind spot monitoring, lane keeping assist, automatic emergency braking, and more. At the end of the day, this updated F-150 is all about optimization. Engineers have taken an already fantastic truck and made it even better thanks to a host of relatively small changes. As for availability, you should be able to pre-order one of these rigs starting right now with a base price of roughly $36,000, though if you want a platinum model with the hybrid drivetrain, you're probably going to be spending a lot more than that. In fact, you definitely will be spending more than that. Next up, watch my full review of the Lightning Pro by clicking right over here. Now, curiously, a lot of the updates that are coming to the 2024 F-150 will not make their way to the Lightning, but don't let that dissuade you because this all-electric pickup truck is still fantastic.